I'm here. No chance of a short meeting. <laughs> well, probably wouldn't have turned out to be one anyway. Uh, let's see. Running down the viewer pipeline, which is pretty thin at the moment, relatively speaking. Uh, the Bento viewer got a new update yesterday, I think it was, uh, that fixed a, a late breaking problem with skin waiting. That well, that wasn't actually late breaking, and just you guys, I think, realized late that it was a vertex thing. Well, it we made it worse with the previous fix. And oh, I so see. We had to, we had to, we had to fix it. Yeah, there's no hurting puppies. That will not better. work well. Right. Um, so that's out. Uh, there are no currently. Fingers crossed. Knock wood. There are no issues attached to that <laughs> viewer that we consider blocking for release. So when it's had enough hours on it. We may be able to promote it unless somebody gets busy and finds more content problems. But uh, so it poses a significant challenge for us um, because, uh, and I realize this, it's like it's not like you guys are intending to do that. But what is our no release window? Sure, we are. Uh, and maybe you are. Maybe you are. <laughs> I don't know. No, no, we're, we're not really. Um, Let's see, what is our, our no release, our no change window? On the 16th. 16th oh, through, 16th. through December the 2nd. Say the, the 17th. No, the, the, sorry, the, the 18th. Say the 18th. The 18th is like a Sunday. Yeah, like a they Sunday. They usually night. do their releases on Sunday nights. We don't do our releases on the weekends. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Why I mean, not? the 18th is in is in our NCW anyway, but um, but will the 18th be all right if we did a release on that day? Uh, as long as you're there to pick up the pieces. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's what it amounts to. So the reason to. why we, the reason, and we don't actually, we don't normally do them on the 18th. Usually, we do them early in the week, um, like on Monday or Tuesday, if we can. All as late as a Wednesday. We don't do them Thursdays or Fridays because you guys have asked us not to. Um, we Why usually will do them on a Sunday. Well, because if we break your servers and you guys have to work, well, no, no, I mean, weekend. Why do you think it's going to take you to the 18th, given that we've only done like a really small number of fixes since the last alpha you did? Uh, well, uh, potentially. Potentially, we could. Okay, let's assume that you guys release it Tuesday ish. Is that realistic? I mean, Tuesday yeah, next, it could be. It could, okay, but let's even say. If, if it's had enough time on it by Monday, we it could even be Monday. Could but, even be Monday. Okay, but, so yeah. and assuming that, Tuesday that can, is easy, that can work. So um, that gives. I, w I would like to have at least a week with it. Um, because it's not just, it's not your guys' changes that we also have to test. Right, but that would be, right? I mean, that would be, so if it's Tuesday, that's the 6th. And yeah. if you have a week, that's the 13th. That's the 13th. So potentially we could release it on the 13th. However, we also just happen to have a Christmas party on the 18th. <laughs> and we have in the past done a Christmas party where we've actually also released, um, and, and given the attendees at the party... First you are grabs gluttons for gluttons for punishment. Oh yes, yes, absolutely. Uh, <laughs> comes well, with the territory. <laughs> it, it's just a thing I'm thinking about. I'm considering. Um, okay, because... I think uh, my take would be this is not a feature you want to be a long time behind us on. No, I know that. That's that's the so. Problem. We can't wait. So for I wouldn't wait for the party. There are other issues as well, um, documentation. So poor Mr. over here does uh, our documentation for our classes. We've got documentation we have to update on the wiki. And um, although I believe that's already begun, um, they like to have a little extra time because they're not they're not paid by the hour. Um, and so giving them a little bit of time to finalize the documentation is, is also nice to them as well. Um, okay. Well, so... 
Um, technically, we are around the week of the 19th. Okay. Except for Friday. Our okay. Christmas actual shutdown begins Friday, but, and it is, it's, it's an important but, not surprisingly, a fair number of people across the organization are planning on taking, yeah, including some of the people here, are planning to take large parts of that week before the winter break to add on to the winter break. You know, it's one of those. I think it's take a take a few, you know take three days of vacation, get twelve. You know, one of those one of those nice things. So yeah. Um, the or whatever the total is, I didn't add it up. Uh, so <laughs> in theory, there are people around, but because of because of the fact that lots of people are taking more time, you know, adding time in that week, we just decided that our no change window is all that week, so there will be no simulator releases. So if anything goes wrong, there won't be anybody to blame but you. Well, if anything, because I'm just looking like if we did on the 18th, then if and let's say worst case scenario, Walker shows up, we've got the 19th to 20th, even the 21st at worst case scenario to get an update out. I don't anticipate yeah. because like you just said, we basically you are not making what you me guys happy here. I yeah. know. I didn't expect it. <laughs> I'm trying to sell it here. I'm trying to sell it. <laughs> um, <laughs> we're talking. We're talking Christmas uh, vacation. Nobody wants to get yeah. phone calls. Okay. And I know we do want to get it out. Certainly before we Christmas. want quiet so, pagers. Yeah. Honestly, we would all prefer if you were Sooner. shooting for the week before that. If it so happens that you absolutely can't do it because. Things happen. Well, let's do this. Let's do this. If you guys can maybe get it not out a Monday. Sunday though, like a Friday morning. Well, okay, can we well, shoot for a Friday do, morning? I'll, I'll tell you why we do a Sunday. Um, it, usually we do it Sunday evening, and that's because a lot of people are not in SL, and the adoption actually is very gradual that way. And by Monday morning, that's when if there was something that's hitting your servers, it's not really going to start hitting them until you know, Monday and people start picking it up. However, if we did it on the 18th, it would be at the anniversary party, which would be at the end of the party, which would be about 4 p.m. SL time, which is not in the evening. And maybe that's not ideal either. So, okay. Just do it during do the week. Do if it as soon as you get, can. If you guys Don't can Don't wait get, for a party. <laughs> if you guys can really. get, if you guys can release on, on the 5th, which is the Monday, then we will strive for the 12th. How's that? How about you'll strive for a week after we ship it? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Whenever well, that is. <laughs> you okay. can start working on it now. Well, yeah, what's but, there the, now? Ansterial, Ansterial we'll... has the rule. Um, she does not merge because you guys have all these project viewers and release canon. Mm -hmm. She doesn't Forks merge anything free. in until you guys... Um, well, and we have a fork, and we're compiling off of Ansterial's pit bucket, in fact, for the alphas yeah, that we've been putting it. out. Start so, your testing. Well, that's what, that's what we've been doing. Well, we've been testing. Okay. Oh, it's running right. to keep away. Uh, so, okay, we'll release a week well, but after do you have guys. Do you have the fixes from yesterday? We don't have your fixes, no, and we won't get yeah. them until you release them. We've They're, they're in RC. Yeah, oh. I know. Yeah, well, Build. I suppose we but here's the problem with this. Let's here's put it this way. This. I'm, we're not going to be real happy if you put something out on the 18th. Okay? <laughs> okay. I got you. I got you. We're not going to be real happy. I got you. <laughs> uh, See, we got to anyway. build it off. we got to build it off LGPL, our final build. If it final goes release. wrong, we will very publicly blame you. Oh, I know you will. <laughs> <laughs> and, and that's only fair because we do that to you all the time, too. So. <laughs> all right. Uh, okay. Let's let's move on. Uh, I think a week after you guys that, release it, we'll release it. I think we've beaten that horse to death. Uh, I give credit. I give credit where credit's due, Grumpy. If you guys do good, you get credit for. It. If you guys mess up, <laughs> you get credit. Everybody, for it. everybody, keep your fingers crossed that we all get a quiet holly. Yeah, right. I'm, I'm really. Um, there's this. also a new maintenance viewer that's out. Um, it has a small test cohort. But it's out there, and we're making progress on that. 
Um, it has, you know, the usual large collection of assorted bug fixes. Uh, and I don't know if any of you noticed, but as of a uh, release or two ago, we now actually pop up the release notes when you launch our viewer the first time after an upgrade, which I think is a cool thing. I actually have started reading them more. And I'm supposed to know what's in them. Well, um, that means my efforts have not been in vain. I'm glad to that's hear That's right. It. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. 64-bit. Uh, mm. Project is making progress. We're wrestling with all sorts of, you know, interesting glitches in the build pipeline. But um, we have successfully run... Uh, viewers that have had problematic functionality temporarily excised, but we we can build viewers that actually launch, and um, that's that's something. So we're getting there. Um, to quickly review, um, when you get to the point, you should be watching that one, and uh, Nikki has been a big help. Uh, the, but there's there are changes in the build process. We have a new version of auto build that is required for the for that branch, and um, the way it the way we set compiler switches for all the library builds and the viewer build to all be compatible and usually identical is that we have a separate repository for those settings. And that, so you have to have checked that out and pointed an environment variable at it to to make the build work right. All of which will end up on the wiki. I just don't want to put it there yet because it would confuse people who are trying to download any other branch right now. Um, but there's discussion of all that on the open source dev list, and we're going to try to keep the discussion of that there um, lively. Uh, so. Um, Hopefully, you know, uh, Project Viewer real soon now. Uh, we're, we're putting a lot of effort into that now. Uh, again, uh, that's it for the pipeline at this point. There's nothing else there. The voice update viewer has still got some bugs we want addressed before we, before we put that out as a Project Viewer. Um, and uh, our new, we're, we've got uh, some new code for managing process viewer processes and doing upgrades um, that uh, is, I think, going to be very cool. We've decided not to release that separately. That will be folded into the 64-bit branch after its first release. So we'll get a version of the 64-bit branch out, and then we'll change how we do updates. That will all be done on that branch. Um, so that's what's out there right now. Oh, and then there's the 360 snapshot viewer, which basically is on hold for a couple of weeks while we, while the developer works on media handling for the for the 64 bit. So that's where all that is. Um, but that will that will pick up again. Um, as soon as the 64-bit media handling is working. Uh, so that's the viewer pipeline. Uh, let's see. Um, the other new topic is everyone's favorite gun-related issue. Uh, oh, yeah. The mislabeled SVC 7532. Mislabeled because... It's actually a, the change was actually a viewer change. Um, that So that's the, the one where we changed the behavior and broke guns in mouse look, if I'm not mistaken. Um, yeah. And uh, the short version is we're going to put it back. Uh, so basically we're going to, we're going to revert that change we're going to close the original issue as expected behavior. Because <laughs> if you, if you read if you read the description of what is supposed to happen, because the 
the change was in how certain events are passed through if they were used by the LSL script. And basically, what we did was pass through events we shouldn't have, because the spec for LL tech controls said, if you set this flag to false, then those events aren't passed through. So we're not going to pass them through. And yes, that will mean that certain things, like touching things, won't work right if you're if some script you've got has taken those controls. So yeah. So that's so that's what so we're going to do with that. So basically, you're just not going to break all the guns in Second Life. We're going to make all the guns in Second Life work again the way awesome. people expect. I can hear the pew pews going on all over the place. Yes. And right. I understand that you guys rescripted your gun. We, we have corrected the scripts. We have updated the scripts on the gun. I don't know they haven't put them out there yet, but the scripts on the guns at the Horizons experience will be updated. So that They, they already have been updated, so currently the guns work with either way and, and work Some. regardless of what the fix is or, right. or is not for SVC 7532. Um, but for... Yeah, a bunch of us went and blasted robots for a while just to make sure <laughs> yeah uh and, and just to point this out i kind of uh hope that now you're not going to go with the solution that allows people to toggle whether they want this to pass through or not oh that's that's a thought um be better to just take that out and be the same as just, yeah we've not... it's just one preference you could kill you know well, it wouldn't have been a preference, I don't think, anyway. We were going to do it just as a debug, I believe. Yeah. I, I think you should just is, make Is it that, a preference? Okay. I think you should just take that preference out. But, you know, if you want to have a preference that will just confuse people and will produce a behavior we no longer have, you know, you guys don't seem to be bothered by having lots of forks and branches in your code. But there you go. Um, we are actually <laughs> a preference. Have a preference. We have those uh, probably. We've got so many damn preferences. So, uh, Grumpy, are we going to put that change into the current mate viewer? Is that where that's going? I can't promise that, but most likely, yeah. Um, we decided not to do the change until we talked. To everyone here, just in case there was some extra complexity that we've been missing, but it appears there isn't, and it's just really simple. We shouldn't have done that fix. Okay. So unless you, unless unless we hear a strong objection, likely you will see a rollback in the main branch for that uh, pretty soon now. Right. That's that's what we have decided we're going to. That's the new story, and we're sticking to it this time. The other thing um, holding us up a little bit on the release is the, the whole um, proprietary stuff issue. Right. And we're, uh, we're working on it. Yeah. And I, you know, I'm I don't, I don't have anything. The head, I don't think I we have anything to say about yeah. it right now. No. I, I understand your frustration with it. Kind of stressing over it. It took us five months to get that license process yeah. completed. So I think the, even if you were to start me, right? now. <laughs> Yeah, it, you know the patent would expire by then. Well, we might we might use uh, an alternative um, potentially. Nikki has been plugging away on something, um, and so I'm sort of faced with uh, the alternative. It's not a not question. It's not good. a question of. It's not a question of having. If, if you have code that decodes MP3s, it doesn't matter what the code is. You could. Be considered to be out of out of bounds. Well, and it's, it's not, not a just question of use of license for MP4, particular code. It's AAC. It's um, uh, our well, DLC some of those some of those others of stuff. Some of those others decoders are okay. 
Well, AAC, for example, Nikki found. Uh, okay. And it's apparently in VLC, and, and they they explicitly, in caps even, on their page, uh, say that you need to have a license with them. Um, and so that really kind of concerns me. Because if we did get sued, I don't think uh, Linden Lab Legal is going to um, defend us <laughs> for free. I wouldn't uh, count so, on yeah, so I, I kind of. On the other hand, it. there wouldn't be that much point in suing you. You don't have any money. No, 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 no. <laughs> it wouldn't stop them from trying potentially. I don't think they would sue us though, anyways, because we are a nonprofit. Um, uh, uh, but they could force a takedown notice, in which case we'd have to block all versions that have it. We'd have to really quickly come up with some kind of a solution, you know. Yeah, I don't. I don't even know, morally, and I, I don't want to get into that here. So, um, anyway, we don't have an answer for you. Sorry, is the real answer right now. So, any other topics? That's that stressful. I don't have any. I'm done, as far as I know, that I can think of at the moment. Have you figured out what to do with your new brims yet? Oh, yes. Oh, the game. Land Impact build... Oz. Don't call them prims. Yes. Yeah, Land, land impact. impact. Get it yes. right. I'm okay. sorry. I, I, um, I blew it. Yeah, we're gonna have we're gonna make a, a, a you know those little mech what do you call those things really what were those things called it's like a little you know like a it's a mech that you sit on and it drives around with legs and stuff we're gonna make like an obstacle course for those <laughs> um, we're going to do and I got Flossie Flossie's here she's our gateway manager and she's cringing at just the thought of adding more stuff um, yeah we're gonna use make all kinds of new features for new blitz. I uh, aware of the next thing. Yeah. Okay. And uh, and how's your gateway doing? Um, good. It's popping right now. Uh, we've got new blitz coming through on a regular basis. We've got our Reg API up. I've got a little bit of a problem dealing with our landing pages. Um, we had an, our um, Canary Beck do up these wonderful uh, landing pages. Uh, Firestorm. Let me just pull you one up really quick here, uh, like like this one, for example. Um, really nice landing pages. Um, and after she made them, and we did some A/B testing, and we determined which ones are nicest or, or you know work the best, um, she disappeared. And when once we got our registration page open, or the Reg API running. Um, I, I went in to edit. You're getting. A, are you serious? Oh, sorry. Sorry. I can fix that. There. Gave you the wrong link. Um, so that's that's one example of the landing pages. Uh, when I went in to edit them to change the sign up free button to actually point to our registration form, um, I realized that they're not actually hosted on our uh, WordPress site. In fact, it looks like Canary made a new WordPress site within our server and I don't have access to it. So that's a bit of a problem. I'm going to have to try to uh, rip these pages and then recreate them, I guess. Um, I'll get around to that soon. Ish. Cool. But uh, otherwise, yeah, no, it's uh, it's it's hopping. Lovely picture. Uh, Flossie did an incredible amount of work on the gateway regions, redesigning everything, and and we've got a new uh, process and expectations from our helpers, and um, uh, so that's that's moving along. So it'll be nice, actually, um, once we get Bento out, then we can just sit back and maybe some of us can actually enjoy Christmas. Cool.
Uh, let me see. Yeah, no, that's that's hers. That is the old thing, and and that is definitely not it. Um, I'll show you our actual uh, form. Right. So this is what you were referring to, where you said you need to redo it, right? Because it's pointing uh, to the old form. Yeah. No, not just that, but just the the this little thing here. Let me take a screenshot. Um, that's our because uh, when I was there. looking for your gateway, this is where I ended up. Yeah, it's terrible that you ended up there. Actually, um, this is that button there on the landing page should be pointing people to the link above it, which is Join Dash Second Life. The Join mm -hmm. Second Life is our portal. Now, the other form that you link to is one that she made. Um, mm -hmm. and I need to take it down because even the search engines are indexing that, and that is not the form. That was like a, a mock-up of the form at, at best, and so right. I've got a bit of a challenge with dealing with that right now. But it's using real Red API caps. The old Red API caps, I believe. Right. I uh, don't think it works. It could be But wrong. yeah, we got to take it down because... Yeah, you know. Absolutely. Um, okay. And uh, so that, that's a bit of a, so what I can do is, all I can do is is delete the WordPress installation that Canary did, but then if I do that, I lose the, these landing pages that she made. So I've got to rip the landing pages first so that I have them, and then I can take down that um, that directory off the server, and that'll get rid of the, the old API. Uh, okay. So, uh, I mean, the other that. thing we can do is turn off the old API. So or that least. too. Yeah, not so at least it's not all together. Yeah, it it should be failing though. Did you try um, using it? It should fail. It, yeah, it's failing, but okay, so maybe we can fail better. I don't know. Yeah, by not having it. Anyway, that's my <laughs> that's my Sunday task. Um, that that'll be my job Sunday. Uh, aside from a gateway meeting as well, I will take care of that. It is stressing me out too. I mean, the, the, honestly, even though they're being indexed, uh, even if you could just repoint the sign up now to the correct gateway, that would solve. I can't though. That's ninety percent of the problem. I understand. Just areas. Need to yeah, yeah. Yeah. Normally, I have redundancy um, with everything. But there's two accounts to everything. Everybody has access to something in case one of us dies. Um, and I didn't. I was not aware that Canary had made a separate WordPress site for these landing pages. And of course, I can't reach her now. Well, so what I will do is I'm going to rip those. <laughs> thanks for the support. I'm going to rip these <laughs> landing pages, um, and then I will just delete the that whole WordPress installation. Okay. And they are doing that too, Pantera. Yeah. That sucks. Sorry. Yeah. Big time. Are we actually any other lost any other hot topics? And Jess was like, "Oh, this meeting's not going to end early because no. I'm here." And now she's got yeah. nothing to talk about. Look at that! Isn't that remarkable? <laughs> it must be distracted hey. or something. It's there's it's always you know it's there's a reason I put this meeting late on Fridays because you know then I can be winding down when it's done. Oh, Worley's asking about the 360 viewer. That's right. Oh yeah. What was the, I missed it? But you can take the snapshots and they download fine. All right. Uh, so did you viewer. get the? There were. There, I think there was an update to the web viewer. And that's when it broke, apparently. Yeah, oh, wait a minute. Let me look. Let me look in our...
You know, in the internal chat channel, it says that if you use the old web viewer, it should work. And it appears to be resolution sensitive. Uh, it, it it appears to be inconsistent for different people, but the the uh, who presumably are on different browsers or something. But that um, that try changing your your resolution and taking it at a different resolution. I meant changing the resolution of the uh, the snapshot you're taking. Some people report that if they pick it at lower resolutions, it, it works. Yeah, okay. Well, like I said, that is on hold. So, not going to fix it. Probably not before Christmas. Oh, come on. Which means not it's until Packers. after New Year's. We're trying to get you a 64-bit build. That's what we're okay, working on okay, in favor okay. of it. Yeah, that's fine. That looks very oh. nice and very popular. Uh, th there are internal reports of problems as well, although some people have reported funding combinations that seem to work for them. So, But it is known that there are there are combinations that definitely don't work, so. Uh, but we'll get, we'll get that sorted. There will be ways to see it. Again. Someday. Um, anything else that I missed back in chat? Is writer like a one finger typer? I don't know. If so, it gets an awful lot of work done for somebody who's a one-finger typer. We did have a developer <laughs> seriously slice like four of his fingers the other day. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, right. Yeah, really put a dent in things. Yeah, all these bandages. Gotta keep sharp objects away from the. We'll look forward to merging that code. <laughs> <laughs> He's actually working on one of the secret new things. Ooh, secret thing. Oh, shoot, there's my door. Darn it. Be right back. All right. Uh, I, I think we're done. All right. Bye, everybody. See you next time next year. Happy holidays. I don't know, Willow. Is it on the calendar still? It is on the calendar. Maybe Oz is wrong. Maybe we'll see you once more. I'll make him delete it, if not. <laughs> yeah, yeah, everybody's getting trigger happy. They're like, so we're not shipping any more things here this year and any more things there this year. I'm like, but wait, more time. Bye.